Hello, and welcome to another video from the Technology Training Team, part of a series that will help educators at Prince George's County Public Schools set up their online courses in Canvas. In this video, we will highlight some accessibility considerations when creating your course content and show you how to use the accessibility check function. Using these accessibility features can make sure your course is available to all learners. When you create your content, here are some things to consider. Assistive technologies often rely on the heading structure to determine the order in which to read content on the page, so it's a good idea to use headings for each section of the page. Don't simply format the text to look like a heading. Instead, select the text, then apply the proper heading level by using the drop-down menu in the toolbar. Additionally, using descriptive text for each heading is helpful for comprehension. Some learners use alt text to describe images on the page. When you insert an image, Canvas automatically adds the image file name as alt text to the image. But it is recommended that you add your own text to describe the image in a way that will be more helpful to student comprehension. To add a new image, click the image icon in the toolbar. Select the image from your computer or paste the URL link to the image. Scroll down to the Attributes section. Enter a description in the Alt Text box. Click Submit. To add alt text to an existing image, select the image, click the Image Options pop-up, enter the text in the Alt Text box. Then click Done. Use bold and italics to emphasize text on your page whenever possible. If you choose to use color formatting, use a color that stands out in high contrast to the background. For example, light blue text on a white background can be difficult for some people to read, while dark blue on a white background is easier. If you want to add a web address to a page, instead of pasting the entire URL, use link formatting. Select text and click the link button in the toolbar. Type or paste the web address into the link text box. Click Done. It's important to make sure that the link text is descriptive, such as the title of the destination website. Using a phrase such as click here is not helpful for comprehension. Once you have written and formatted your text, click the accessibility checker icon. The accessibility checker will list each issue it has detected and offer a method to correct it. Once you have addressed the first issue, click Next to move on to the next one. When finished, click Apply. And those are some basic guidelines for considering accessibility when creating content in Canvas. Be sure to check out other videos in our Canvas tutorial series. This has been another production from the Technology Training Team. Thanks for watching.